Okay, guys, so we got Violet from Mesa on the line. What's going on in your relationship, Violet? Uh, well, I wish I wasn't calling you because it's something bad, but it is. Um, basically, okay. I'm pretty sure that my husband is cheating on me. We, uh, we basically don't spend a lot of time together because after deciding to put our son into private high school, I went back to work, mm -hmm. so now I'm pretty much working all day, and then he works overnight. Oh. So we're like that two ships passing in the night, you know, scenario. Mm -hmm. We see each other at dinner, that's about it. Mm -hmm. Pretty much he's been pulling away, and, you know, the suspicions were confirmed when I was cleaning the house a few weeks ago, and in the freaking couch cushions, I found not only a condom wrapper, but a thong that was definitely not mine. A thong? Yeah. Okay. Whoa. How big were they? Yeah. Oh, well, oh my gosh! Like extra Joey. small. Man, okay. Extra small. Uh, okay. Yeah, like tiny, tiny Whoa. little girl. All right. So wait, wait, wait. You say you guys yeah. are working for your son's education. Is he like graduation age? Is there a possibility yeah, yeah. that this is your son's, son's yeah. type of deal? He, he is in high school, and it was so uncomfortable because I sat him down and said, "Hey, we got to talk," and I questioned him. Thinking maybe it was his. He's a senior in high school. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, and we transferred him to a private school, you know, junior year for his last two years. Okay. Um, and he basically was like, Mom, like, where are you? I haven't had sex yet. I'm a virgin. Which I'm like, thank you, Jesus. Uh, I did something. Like, <sighs> but at the same time, he looked at me, like, right on the same page as me, like, well, if it's not me, who is it? It obviously must be Dad. Uh, you know? So, wait. You, so, now even your son thinks that your husband's cheating on you? Well, we had a conversation that night, obviously, which continued. My husband was working, and yeah, like she basically is just it's not his, and says, "Well, if it's not my mom, who is it? It is dad." You know. Oh, and now I'm like, wow! What a little snitch. Yeah, this is Joey. really yeah. messy. Okay. So wow. it's even more weird now because for the last week and a half, my son and I—it's just like walking on eggshells. And mm -hmm. I'm, mm -hmm. I need to know, but at the same time, like if he is cheating on me, well, I don't know. Everything just needs to be either affirmed one way or the other. I mean, right. we have had. I will say this: I can't remember the last time I cleaned out the couch. I'm sure my son has. Had had a party or two and he did say that too you know like mom i've had a couple parties here some of my friends are having sex you know like there's, there's possibilities you know but at the same time it is my house and yeah, yeah. this we, sucks I mean, though because now it's like the kids suspects of their dad cheating yeah, on their mom that's just that's weird well, for your son awkward. hopefully so uncomfortable. he's so telling uncomfortable. the truth at the same time if he is that then that means bad somewhere else yeah. in the house so i don't know it sounds like you guys are really busy you're in the thick of things with your kid being in high school and stuff like like that and um i think it's probably really easy and natural for you guys to feel distant at this time i'm a little hopeful that maybe there's something else going on here because just just because you found something doesn't mean that's the only person that's been in the house within the past few yeah, months especially I think with your, your son, son is lying he's a high really? school kid yeah i mean uh, wait has your I husband ever cheated on you before have you ever caught him no i mean up until like when we decided to put our son in private school i felt like our relationship was really great mm -hmm. but now that i'm working and he's working you know we definitely aren't into as much as we used to be. We're busy oh, with our son. Right. I, I mean, I am like, you guys, he's pulling away. I'm freaking out. But at the same time, I want to think the best and I want to think that he wouldn't, right. A, bring a girl into our home. Right. Yeah. Never mind some extra Well, at least he just used a sofa, not your bed, because then that would be disrespectful. Stop. In his defense, <sighs> it sounds like you guys are both really busy. So hopefully he just doesn't have the time for this and then we right. can figure out what's going on. Mm -hmm. So let's just get down to it. I'm sure you've been. Oh, man, my heart's beating so fast right now. Okay, I was going to yeah, say. You're gonna, you're gonna call him, right? Yeah. 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 So okay. I'm sure you've had yeah. swirling scenarios in your mind for weeks. Let's just get it out of yeah, the way. Yeah, we'll give him a call oh from God, a little oh romantic uh, staycation at a hotel. See who he wants to take. And obviously, if he doesn't say your name, he's cheating on you with the sofa bandit. Oh if God, he you says, guys are freaking out. My pops are like okay, right well, don't freak out. out. Don't freak out. Okay. Hold on, right there. Okay. We're gonna get his number. Uh, oh. It'll be like uh, you go to the doctor's. A quick shot. It won't hurt a bit unless okay. he's cheating on you. Oh, then great. it's gonna hurt a lot. Please, let's be honest. Staycation setup. Calling her husband. Up next. Good morning, Mass. It's live. Damn, I'm even nervous about this one. I have no idea where this is going to go. Mm -hmm. I, wow. Hello? Oh, good morning. Hello? Is Jacob available? Uh, Yeah, this is him. Hi, Jacob. My name is Jonathan. I'm with the Aurora Hotel, and I'm calling because we're doing a limited time special for couples in the Valley. So with your permission, you have a chance to take someone on a complimentary romantic weekend in our penthouse suite. So I wanted to know first if that was something you were interested in. A complimentary... A complimentary what? A romantic stay in our penthouse suite. Com uh, the top of the complimentary where 
in a few minutes you're going to ask me for my credit card number for taxes and fees and things like that, right? No, I, I promise, Jacob. I, I can understand that this might sound a little bit weird, but this is free of charge. We do ask for something in return, but it's just an honest review of your experience online, and that's something that we can handle later. But if you really are interested in this, to get the reservation started, we need the name of the guest that you'd like to bring. So who would you like to bring with you? Uh, well, quick question. Is it for the whole weekend? It's Saturday and Sunday? Yeah. Actually, you start off Friday night, and then it goes until Sunday. Oh, okay. Um, is it possible to split the days? Could I bring a total of two guests, but it would be, you know, like one at a time, one on Saturday and, or Friday night, Saturday, and then one Saturday night to Sunday? Um, well... I mean, I've never heard that before, to be honest with you. It sounds a little different. This is a romantic... Okay. Let me level with you. Let me level with you. You've got a guy, okay? Uh, okay. I'm married. It's not a happy marriage, but uh, I've got kind of a, a little interest, and it would be really great to spend some a family time and also Jacob, get some stress me time. Are you kidding me right now? Are you oh. kidding me right now? A little interest. What? Hello? Marriage is not whatever you just said. I don't even know what you just said. Are you kidding me right now? Violet, is that you, Violet? Jacob, uh, really quick, before we talk to your probably soon-to-be ex-wife you're live on the radio Whew. that's violet it's joey oh. lanish oh this is far for the course okay yeah. go ahead violet jacob are you having an affair are you cheating on me yes i'm f***ing other girls and you know this because the last time you touched my f people were talking about how the saints should still win the super bowl like oh well damn what does well, that mean that means it's been a while lanish it's been a long time you know you've got some real nerve getting on the radio well yeah she got on here and she was like oh our marriage is so great we're so happy together we've got oh, a wonderful God. time doing so oh, great whoa so you were listening oh, to the show wow. yeah. Jacob, you yeah. well i just know that i know the game i know what she does in social settings she does the same thing with all of our friends and family everything's perfect wait jacob i called to tell them that i found you know what you can just save it you can save it all in our, in our you can and i wanted to know if you were cheating on me and I, you know what your son knows that you're cheating i have made no effort to hide it from you Wow. Wait, here's the big question. Why do you guys stay together? Yeah, what? We have a son. We have a son. And that, but... somehow she's managed to get me wrapped around her finger so that I can't, like, live my free life. Well, clearly you are because you have some other person. He's not ashamed. He's fully owning it. Yeah. I can't I mean, even front on this guy. It's probably a relief that he got caught at this point. I don't understand why there has to be these, like, deceptive shenanigans get me on the phone and on the radio when she knows what's happening. Violet, why don't you, if it's an unhappy marriage, why do you not just get out of this relationship? Oh, my God. Oh. Because I love him and because we have a son together. And oh. she wants to I keep her family that. together. I get it. I get it. But it's, it's, she's, it's unhappy. It's unhealthy. It is. You know what? It's not unhappy. We're just busy and we're doing, I'm doing the best I can. To Jacob get seems very unhappy, Violet. It's pretty unhappy. You know what? It's pretty unhappy. I don't even know what to um, do. You and, you know, to, to be honest, I've had enough of airing my dirty laundry today, so I'm oh going to go. Oh, my God. <gasps> no. Hello? He hung up. Violet, I'm sorry that this is what it is, but why don't you just divorce him? He obviously... Well, I mean, now I have no choice. Like, I'm so disgusted. I feel gross. Ugh, who knows? Who knows what trash he's, like, bringing into the house. It's yeah. not on a home. That's disgusting. I, oh, my God. I know no. we learned he's a cheater, but we still don't know if that was what happened in the house. Like, are we just assuming well, those two are the same thing? I don't even think it matters. Problems. He's obviously cheating on her, and he obviously admitted he does. No, yeah. that's a good point. Yeah, There's obviously, still... but, but that's still out there. Like, what happened with that? I don't know. I, I would advise you, though, handle one thing at a time. Right now, let's stay focused on the marriage. I am so sorry. This is probably one of the most insane staycations that I've been a part of. But It's the most honest one, though. He admitted it. He doesn't want to be in the relationship. Violet, I, I think you just, you shouldn't be together. Certain people are just no, not meant to be. Clearly. And you shouldn't stay yeah. together for kids. Ladies and gentlemen, never do that. Because all you're hurting is the kids. Watching mom and dad fight all the time. And your son knows that dad's been cheating on you. And you're just going to. That is so terrible. Oh, well, I definitely. He's never not once come to me and said that he wasn't happy. You know what I mean? Like, he should have been a man. He should have come to me and said, hey, it's not working. I'm not happy. I need this, or I need that, or I want this, or I want that. And I wouldn't, like, bent over. <laughs> he would take bent over backwards. Cause, no, I don't even want to say that. That's yeah, hard. because he was bent over oh, backwards with someone yeah. else. Yeah. But, you know, I would have done anything to, like, work on it and make him happy. Counseling, freaking role playing. I don't even care. Whatever, right. But role play. Hello. So Listen, we're going to give you the counseling number yeah. off the air. Just yeah. in case he has, maybe he has remorse. Maybe if you call him and you talk to him and want to go to counseling, please keep us posted. You know, he got caught up, but it feels like it's unhealthy, especially yeah, for your son. Yeah. Well, thank you guys for your help. I do love your show. I thank you for your help. And uh, 
New uh, start, I guess. Fresh uh, start. All right, hon. Well, keep us posted, okay? Yeah. All thank right. you, guys. All right. Bye. My goodness.